We're having our annual Pet Palooza. This is our second year that we're doing it, and basically we bring a lot of uh, vendors and, and uh, uh, pet-related people and, and uh, so suppliers, things like that, um, out to the shelter, and, and then of course we also try to do as many adoptions as we possibly can. Um, but we have a little bit of everything. We have our search and rescue dogs are out and uh, doing demonstrations. We have um, Ask the Trainer. We have pictures with Santa. We have um, our agility dogs in the back. So, you know, there's just everything going on and it's just a, been a really fun event uh, for, for people and, and their pets uh, alike. We work with a group called Sparky's Pals, which is an educational um, group. They, they uh, are nonprofit and they help um, agencies like us put on these types of events and uh, uh, you know it becomes an educational event for us so we can talk to the public and uh, uh, get the word out about how wonderful um, uh, shelter pets are and uh, how great it is to adopt them. Shelter dogs are, and cats are wonderful. I mean you can get just about any breed you're looking for, you know, all sizes, shapes, colors, um, you know, and, and you don't have to go to a pet store or a breeder or something like that to adopt. I mean, these, they're wonderful. I mean, literally hundreds of, of wonderful pets um, here that are just looking for that second chance to have a, a family that's going to take care of them for the rest of their lives. And, um, you know, it doesn't matter what you're looking for, we have it. And uh, if we don't have it today, it'll be here tomorrow or sometime in the near future. I can pretty much guarantee it. Plano has made a wonderful commitment to the pets and the people who own pets in the city. We uh, uh, have one of the highest placement rates, um, if not the highest placement rate in the state um, for a municipal animal shelter. Um, and we're very proud of that fact. Our staff does a great deal in making sure that these animals go home um, and, and have places that will take care of them for the rest of their lives. Um, and, you know, the, the city is wonderful about supporting us in that mission. You know, the, the citizens are the ones who, who, who expect um, this type of service and want um, animals treated humanely and, and treated properly. And uh, the city listens to what its citizens want. And uh, that's why we're able to do and, uh, what we do and provide the services that we provide.